Why do I need the headset? I'm right here. You rolling? Okay. Take one. Postseason baseball. If your team is in it, it's two different sports, really. Home games and away games. At home, you want insane screaming, jumping, dancing, pushing, punching. Away, you just want quiet. I love close-ups of losing home team fans. Their crushed lives, shattered dreams, and hopeless future. A painted face with a single tear rolling down. The didn't work rally caps and crumpled hit it here signs. I don't even mind devastated little kids. They might as well learn now how bad things can go. Four teams left, four different personalities. I don't know who the Guardians are. Sounds like their parents left and that's who's taking care of them. But I love Cleveland because of Harvey Picar comic books. A Dodger game is glamorous. Everyone looks so good. It isn't a game as much as a personal appearance booked by CAA. That's why they leave early. Once the director has all the angles of the scene I'm in, we're out of here. Yankee fans do not understand losing. How could this happen to me? In their minds, they're always in the middle of a dynasty. Yankee fans are losers pretending to be winners. Mets fans are also losers, but we have no need to hide it. We know who we are. We love our Mets no matter what. The Mets are all we have. They know it and we know it. And yes, we also know we're not that physically attractive. We don't care. We know love is more important. It's how we were raised, like Casey Stengel and Marv Throneberry. Whoever takes it this year, good for you. Maybe you were the best. Maybe you just got a little lucky. Behind the back! Just remember, your happiness made a lot of innocent children cry. Pretty good. Jerry Seinfeld on tour, by the way, will perform select days with Jim Gaffigan, so look out for that in 2025. More information, jerryseinfeld.com. He's here all the time. Sure, he's here tonight. And I know you dealt with him in the World Series and Subway Series, right? I did. I got a quick story with Jerry Seinfeld. We're playing the Subway Series in 2000, and it was before Game 4. I'm leading off the game, and the Mets roll out the Baja men, and they're singing Who Let the Dogs Out in front of the Mets dugout. And I just happened to look over at Jerry, and I just shook my head. And then we ended up winning that game. We won game five. I ran into him a couple years ago. He was telling me the story. I bought a Baja Men CD. I signed it. We both knew it was over after this and send it to him. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, uh, I look forward to uh, our game four when the Baja Men perform on set here with us <laughs> on FS1 to kick off the game. Who let the dogs out? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh man. <laughs> that, that.